Hi everybody, Andy here with eTrailer.com. Let's take a look at these Dometic Go folding camp chairs. Now these camp chairs are going to give you a pretty comfortable and supportive place to sit when it's time to take a break from your outdoor adventures. These are gonna be great and comfortable chairs to have when you're at your campsite or a really any outdoor function. And as you can see, we do have three color options here for you to consider. So the first color is my favorite one, and this is called Glacier. This is a, a light blue color. And then we have um, gravel here in the middle, and that's more of like a, a light gray color. And then there at the end, we have uh, ash, which is gonna be a light tan color. So depending on the color that you're looking for, just take the item number that you see there on your screen and pop it in the search field for your uh, in our website and that will take you to that particular color that you are looking for. So as you can see, these chairs do have a pretty sleek design. If you notice, they, they sit in more of a reclined position than an upright position. So it, it, it's, it's going to give you uh, a more comfortable uh, way to sit than a lot of uh, outdoor chairs that you might find on the market. And so let me go ahead and give you some measurements right up front just so you have a good idea uh, of, this, of the size of the chair and if it's going to work for you. Let's begin with the height. So measuring from the top of the back all the way to the ground, we're gonna be sitting about 32 inches tall. And then the depth measuring here from the front most part of our chair all the way to the back, we're sitting at about 28 and three quarters inches deep. And then looking at the width from uh, outside arm to outside arm, we're sitting at about 24 and 9 16 inches wide. And then probably a more uh, important measurement for you is inside arm to inside arm. It's gonna be about 21 inches wide. And so, like I said, it's a, it's a pretty comfortable place to sit. There are a few things that I wanna point out that um, might that uh, would, would be good for you to consider uh, when you are thinking about buying an outdoor chair. The first thing that I notice is there's no uh, cup holders, so um, you're not gonna have a place to conveniently uh, put uh, a beverage. Um, uh, you're gonna have put it on the ground or something like that. There's no table on the side to maybe put your phone down or a book or something like that. So if you're looking for an outdoor chair that has those additional features like a cup holder or a table, um, we do have those options available uh, here at eTrailer.com if you wanna take a look at it. But with these chairs, you are gonna be gaining a, a really good looking outdoor chair and some comfort. These do sit a little bit lower than some other outdoor chairs as well. I measured what the height would be from the seat to the ground and that's about 14 and a half inches tall. So you will be sitting a little bit lower in these chairs. But these chairs are very durable. As you probably already saw, we have an aluminum frame. So not only, not only is it going to be lightweight, these weigh a little under nine and a half pounds, but they're gonna be very durable. They're gonna hold up really well for you. And they're very easy to collapse as you can see there. So they're gonna fold up really easily and you're not gonna to have to worry about any latches or hooks and then they're gonna unfold very easily as well. And then it's going to be very stable uh, when you have it unfolded and on the ground. The maximum weight capacity of these chairs is gonna be 280 pounds. And let me give you another close up. I just wanted to give you a closer view of our fabric. This is going to be a heavy duty 600 denier fabric. So this fabric is made to withstand the elements. It's gonna hold up really well uh, against, if you get caught in the rain or something like that, I think spills are gonna clean up uh, really easily uh, from that fabric as well. And if you notice, we do have a pouch here at the back and I have the included carrying case in that pouch. You can use that pocket or pouch for virtually anything that you want, but I think it's a pretty handy place to uh, put the included carrying case. And I'd kind of like to give you a demonstration of that. Uh, each of the cases uh, of each of the, uh, of the chairs there, I do have in the, in the pouch there at the back. So you're gonna get a color matching uh, carry case. And as you already saw, it's very easy to fold. So I'm just gonna bring it up just like that. 
and this is what it's going to look like when it's completely collapsed. And then this does give you a pretty wide opening. And so I'm just going to go ahead and slide this into the bag like so. Make sure I get my feet in there. And then just bring this around. And then the zip, the zipper seems pretty durable. So I'm going to go ahead and it's got little poles on it too to make it easier to zip. And then just as simple as that, we've got two straps on this. By the way, the, the case is, uh, is made of the same uh, material as the fabric of the chair. We got a shoulder strap here. It's going to make it very easy to uh, transport your chair while you're carrying other things with your hands. But then we also have a top strap here as well. It's going to give you another place to uh, transport it, carry it. You can even use that to maybe hang it up in your garage when you're storing it. And so these are going to be very easy to transport, uh, very easy to store, and they really do come with a nice, attractive, color matching bag as well. So if this is a chair that uh, a type of chair that uh, you think you would be uh, happy with. Um, this would be really a great item for you to consider from each all the specs that you're looking for. And you just pick the color that you want. But like I said, if you're looking for a chair that's got cup holders on it, maybe a, a little table or something like that that's more uh, of a traditional outdoor chair, we do have those options here at eTrailer.com as well. Well, I think that's going to wrap up our look today. I do hope that it was helpful for you. Again, my name is Andy. Thank you for joining me.